Welcome to Metro Vancouver Close-Up, your look at sustainability in Metro Vancouver. Clean tech industries have advanced environmental performance and the sector is expanding in areas such as construction, transportation, energy and utilities. LED lighting is one of those clean tech industries and it's one that the city of Surrey is plugging into. The city of Surrey is fast becoming a leader in sustainability. And in the Newton area, they're starting to lighten up the city's centre. We're going to be replacing 28,000 uh, high pressure sodium street lights with LED lights. And that's going to be done over a five year period. So first year we'll do about 7,000 starting in our city centre in North Surrey. We've definitely been a proponent for the LED lights for quite a while. We were definitely a part of the pilot project that happened at the bus loop um, initially to, to see the feedback on the LED lights. It made it easier to be seen. Uh, people standing there in the evening, even just with a, a newspaper, the light that was coming off it was, was cleaner and easier to see. So they took that pilot that was there and they moved it from uh, 138th all the way to, to King George Boulevard and the feedback that they got was phenomenal. The first phase of LED replacements has begun, starting at 137th Street and 72nd Avenue. I always like to bring people over to the map to sort of showcase of what Newton looks like. On 72nd, the new lights will be going east to west, and it gives a direct comparison to the other lights on 137th, which are the darker, gloomier lights. There's a number of advantages to the LED lights. The first would be the lower cost, so because it's a much lower energy consumption, we save about a million dollars a year on power with the LED lights. These last about 15 to 20 years as compared to five years with the previous uh, lights we were using. The other ones were filling the landfill. Every five years they'd go out there, they'd change a light bulb, they'd put it into the landfill and, and start it all over. It basically it provides a very uh, natural light uh, without dark and light patches, so it's better for safety for pedestrians and drivers. The number one focus at the, the Newton BIA is, is safety, and it has been for a while. And the, the gloom that the old lights and the infrastructure had in the area, and the replacement of the LED lights, that really increases the safety in the area by illuminating the streets. The new LED fixtures attach to the current 28,000 poles. What is really uh, unique, I think, lift the top and you have full access to the LED light. So you don't have to dispose the whole light fixture. Each component can be replaced independently. So it's very great for maintenance. The lamps allow for future technology additions like remote control light dimming or Wi-Fi communication. We're gonna do a pilot and see how it works and what we might wanna do with that for the future. What we're doing is probably going to be taken notice by the other cities in, in the country. I mean, it's, it's a simple solution. 